Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 17 here on No Creek Farms. Should be episode 19 if I'm not mistaken. But folks, how y'all doing today? Y'all doing all right? Uh, oh, what's that? I'm full of energy. What? Eh, a little bit. But if I don't get these beans cutting pretty soon, I'm not going to be full of nothing. Um... Basically, I got Phil, well, hold on, I can't do nothing while I'm, uh, let me jump out the combine here, get the, this back up, as you can see, we're about to get some rain, we still got all these beans in the ground, I got Phil 7 done, uh, Jamie's up there plowing right now. All right, let's stop right there. And let's go ahead and unload real quick. While we're unloading, we're going to run through. As you can see, folks, we're ready to harvest soybeans. Corn. We already got the corn done. Should be, I think. Let's go, go ahead and double check real quick. Yes, as you can see, there is no fruit type on uh, 3 and 4, so it's done. Now, as you can see, 7, that's what James got left to uh, plow. And uh, we just made a, a through around the top and west side of field 8. We're going to knock out 10, then get back into 8. Probably knock out field 9 while we're here. Uh, our wheat still growing down uh, field number one, and that's what we got our soybeans so far. And the price is going up. As soon as that arrow takes off, I'm gonna sell a load. All right, we're done unloading, and we're gonna get busy. There we go. We are harvesting. I'm gonna do the outer edge around these trees um, if not um, <laughs> our hard workers going to have a little bit of a challenge folks oh yeah we got the Massey Ferguson and the house oh, I hope I ain't missing them nope Ooh, barely But folks, um, no exciting news. Um, just remember, this video is a week ahead. Right now, I'm staying exactly a week ahead on my videos. Uh, dealing with my two kids uh, and their school life and everything else. And uh, fire department so far. Um it's probably going to be before this video, but I'm not for sure. But anyway, go check out. It's going to be uh, I'm probably just going to be a fast forward music video type deal of the storm that we had on April the third, and uh, but yeah, it's. Today is the 4th, I believe, or is it the 5th? Anyway, it's the 4th or the 5th, but on April the 3rd, we had a pretty good storm come through. Um, not in our area, but we did have some low-lying clouds. But a couple of the neighboring towns had a couple of tornadoes that come through. Nobody got hurt that I know of, but it was a lot of, a lot of damage, uh, especially wind damage. I should say I can't be full already. I'm a quarter of the way. Alright. Our planter couldn't get up in that corner there like I wanted it to. Alright. To be no creep. And yes, folks, I'm going to say, oh, 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 don't, don't scratch your cab. Oh, that's just barely. Uh, 
Uh, it barely fit under that tree. Uh, as you can see, we're almost to the last point. Uh, there on the map on the bottom left. We're going into our last point, then we're going straight back up to where we started. And then I'll hire out a worker. And uh, we'll go from there. I just hope I can make it up there because I did not, or excuse me, I did not have the uh, auger wagon to follow me. That's too sharp of a turn right there to make. I had to leave some of these beans. Woo. A tight fit. Uh actual combine driver would hate doing around the trees like this because as the season hurt or goes about and stuff trees get older a lot of limbs will fall and usually the, the first through you, you get all those and you got to make sure you don't get them in the header because um you can really have some technical difficulties. Halfway full and three quarters of the way around, so I think we're going to be doing pretty good. Um, all that beating scares me. I'm afraid something's going to go wrong. We're going to be doing a, a late night work. Uh, trying to beat the rain. Got to beat the rain. I don't know how much longer. It is. I can't remember how long I was into working before that symbol popped up. Usually, when it first pops up, you got a couple of hours. Okay, I'm gonna stay out of the bushes. I want to try to. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Not to mess up anything. Just trying to straighten that curve up a little bit. All right, let's see which way he's going to go. Oh, oh, hang on, hang on. I gotta do something here. Gotta turn that on so I can see uh, which way he's going to go. hold out right there for a minute we're gonna go ahead and pull up under here and unload again and then we're gonna get the show on the road for sure then and I'm gonna, I'm gonna change out one more oh not that this uh, go in this way Wait during the unload on. Oh, that's not good. Oh, I didn't want that. Oh, yeah. That's more like it. We're going to see how that's going to work. Now, this is a truck. This is what we got so far. But, um, hopefully we can get this field done. And, uh, we can cut a, a roadway through there. That way you don't have to go all the way around. And that's what we're working on right now. The animals, um, I need to check. Uh, we got four cows, 66% health. Um. They're going good, looks like. 91% clean. So that's a good deal. Um, let's see here. We do have a 300000 loan that we're still processing paying back. So that's why I want to sell some cans. Or sell some cans. Ha! 
sell some beans as far as we can. Where is Jamie? She's still working? Yeah, she's on the way back. So, I think she left a spot or two right over there. We're going to have to clean up. But other than that, doing pretty good. Uh, who we got on the combine? Max Sands driving the combine. All right. So, it shouldn't be too much longer on this field here. Uh, quarter ways on an auger wagon. If we can, um, Spruce up that field there before hand. Now we do have field seven fertilized, the fertilized buggies up there to the front of us there. That'd be the west. And um, our trees are really dying, folks. It's autumn, mid autumn. It's looking beautiful. Uh, we're going to let Jamie go a little bit. we got to get up on this combine here. And we'll watch this corner. It's, uh, it does good on the curves and stuff, but a sharp point like this, is, it, they don't do well. That's where I'm going to take over. And get this point knocked out. Oh, thank God I didn't miss none. Uh, what I want to do is just kind of take it down a little bit here. and get this back knocked out. There we go. And I really, really hate the way this straw is. Now, don't get me wrong. I love it. I love the new textures and stuff of it. But uh, you, you just can't, when it goes over into the part that hasn't been thrashed yet, it really has a hard time of seeing. Unless you like inside the cab view or something. I bet you I missed. No, I actually got it. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and let him take hold of that. And we're going to check on. I found out something too. Uh, like if I'm here and I hit zero and you can see right here it's got a P okay on that in there that's the auger the small auger it's got a P beside of it say the skid steer here let's go down to it hang on a second I gotta I gotta make this turn for him Almost missed that. I did miss that. And we are right. Um, let's see here. Left my header up. We're going to back up. And no, we're not going to get that spot we missed. We're going to go this way real quick. I'll just set and do it. Talk to you, hopefully. But anyway, it's the skid steer here. Oh, don't miss none. Why are you talking? If I hit uh, the plus on the key, uh, the number pad, which is in with my keyboard, you can see how it puts a P there beside of it. Uh, we'll never go to that skid steer again. And y'all like, what? Uh oh. There we go. Oh, we got Jackie working now. They're gonna. But, uh, also, um. I think this is our fertilizer rig right here. We'll just go up one. 
hit the plus on it, I'll put a P beside of it, and we'll close that out. And then I'm just going to let him go. And so we'll go ahead and unload, and we'll come back and finish that the next time around. But uh, as we tab over, you can see the skid steer is not in it no more. So say like we want the the Chevrolet right here, we we can uh, go do it also. Um, we do that right there. Just hit the plus, and then back out of that. No truck, no skid steer. I love it, folks. I really do. Let's see here. It's going to be kind of challenging here because I want to make sure we unload an auger wagon to chaser bin. So um, i got to just finish up Jamie's little side spots here that she missed. Oh, that would figure. Jackie is blocked. Okay. No no problem on that. No problem. What what the heck? Terminator popped in my mind, folks. I'm gonna go ahead and unload because uh I'm glad I caught her. Alright, we're gonna hit R. Got sunset right there. That is perfect. All right. Get that back on. Let's see. Well, let's just go ahead and stick with the game for a second. Uh, I am curious to see who's uh. Mr. Yankee's driving. All right. Uh, let's see here. I should be able, Yeah, we still got the steer on. We can mainly steer the combine to help out. But it will still be faster this way. Up. Pick up a header. Swing around. There we go, and our work again. Oh, we got Max Sand back on the job. Okay. Um, that worked out about right. I just ha hate because you have to restart it every time. Just have to be a little bit. I'm gonna back up and get that instead of turning around. Lower it down and go to town. All right, that's all of them on this end. Ah, uh, let's go on down here real quick. Max is still going down, so uh, should be a problem. Because we wouldn't be going this fast across these rows. Now we're going the other way, that way. I, I can kind of see it, but. I'm not really worried about getting the rest of the fields plowed. I just want this one. 
cloud pretty much I gotta switch over perfect timing oh 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 don't do it don't do it forgot I had it on the hater this is gonna go until the uh, hater whiff is fully crossed about right in there I'm going to turn around and knock this out. If you put it on the front header and then hit the L, LB and V, it'll raise and lower the header without shutting the combine off. So I just I figured that looks more realistic than I haven't shut the whole combine off. Didn't take very long to knock this out. Just think we had a 60 foot header. If we had a 60 foot header, it wouldn't be no way of getting in here. Not at all. Alright, I'm on. Go down this way. And then, uh. Come back down and go up. And uh, we'll have us knocked out. Especially if I take a full header. Maybe in cab be just a little bit easier to see. Not much. But I want to apologize in advance if y'all hear me sniffling. Uh, coming down with a sinus cold or something. It being 75 um, by 3 p.m. and then turning down to 33, 34 degrees. <sighs> later that night don't help me I'm gonna go ahead and hire out real quick um, I'm gonna pull this up just a little bit that right there Right, we're gonna go ahead and go around back up here and turn back on and we're gonna hire back out for a second and finish up this real quick Yeah, yeah, I actually got it all. Well, not all. I like this little spot, but I'm go over here and get this. That's a tiny bit there. And it looked like there's a tiny bit right there. Wow. Yep, there's a tiny bit. And that is done. I'm gonna go ahead and fold this thing up. Uh, we can't cross right there. We're gonna have to go down here. We probably could cross, but why we need to go down here and just do it? 
I guess that's why they put these little slews in. Alright, we're gonna switch back over real quick. Wow, he done made another loop around. Okay, well, we're gonna let him. I don't know how they're gonna do that other corner there, but we're gonna. I wish the engine would stay started long enough where I could do something. Get down in here. Too bad it wouldn't let you this like S right here. Put the like turn roads or something. I think I can get around. Without damaging any crops. Or it's getting dark 30, ain't it? Dark 30. Dark 30. And we are. And that's something we got at one other field done in 30 minutes. That's 26 minutes right now in, folks. Ain't that something? Mm. I'm going to go ahead and unfold and we'll start right here. It won't take long to get this field knocked out for sure. Are you going? <laughs> Good thing I, I went over. I'll just go ahead and finish up. Now the, the deer is going to stay running. Now I do have a new Challenger Combine that a youtuber gave to me um, I told him I'd be showing it off on my channel and I'm putting his link down below in the description but uh, it's gonna be a while before we can get a combine um, so what I'll probably do I really don't know how to do it I guess I have to do it on one of the other maps but I would really love to have it on this map first. But it will be coming to this map. Alright, we actually got this done. I, I'm kind of happy in a way, and in a way I ain't. Because the way I am, we'll get the. I don't have to take it all the way around. We can just uh, drive the combine through there so that he can dump in the truck. But on the other way, uh, but of course this field ain't very big, so buggy load of beans, a okay in a way. I just wish they did yield just a little bit different. Now I'm gonna put this guy on follow me and oh, yep okay start the engine first. Okay. And Donna. Okay, Donna's going to be driving the, the tractor for us. All right. Yay, Donna. Come on. Come on, Donna. Yeah, there you go. gonna give us plenty of room down through here so there's a turn road right there uh, I need to remember this when I plant it is not to plant up here and to leave a turn road down through there but you know I, I want to, to take every dollar or every bit of grain I can so we can sell it and I wasn't thinking when I was planting the turn road but yeah, that's pretty much a turn road down through there. What is the turn road? 
Well, it's just it's simply that. It's a road that you go down and turn around on and whatnot and stuff like that. So that's what I'm going to do before I get into field nine there is actually go all the way down. Excuse me, folks. I slept not good last night. Not good at all. Uh, probably about two hours. And I hate recording when I'm, I'm sleepy because, you know, yawning and then y'all yawn. See right there is where the turn road comes out at. And it should go straight across there. Yeah. But, uh, that's all right. We're going to harvest over to it. And then come back. And uh, we're, we're going to start in these two fields. You know, probably like, well, which one's nine? Well, both of those are nine, considered nine. Uh, that field and this field is nine. But, uh, this part here has good drainage. So we're going to take out field nine. Uh, next on our list goes uh, uh, Donna back there staying with us. We're just going to go ahead and go down and back to here, then jump in there, get that field knocked out, and then the other part of mine, and uh, go from there. But yeah, that's why I've been uh, getting quiet there because I've been yawning. And I hate it, folks. I hate it. I hate to watch other YouTubers do that. You know, that they'll be going on along there and all of a sudden they, they yawn. And then it makes you do it. And then the next thing you know, the rest of the room's doing it. And I just don't think it's right. You know, it's not right to my viewers to have to make them yawn. But then again, I'm going to apologize. I ain't been getting very much sleep like I should. Alright, we have made it to our truck again. So I'm just going to go ahead and dump it in there. I'm going to hit Control F. Now stop Donna. Inner tracks. I should have dumped in the truck, the truck a hole a little bit more, but basically what I want to do right now, before this rain catches us off guard, whoa, there's a hill there. I want to go ahead and unload this into the truck and go empty this truck out all right that's good should be good enough we love how the tractor just sits there and shakes that's kind of how it does in real life in a way it's not that bad it's more of a rhythm to it with the PTO running all right our truck is full but our, our uh, gravity wagon ain't going to be. It's a beautiful sunset. Alright, well we're going to cut a little bit more, but we're going to have to be on our toes. So I'm just going to leave a tractor here. All right, start the combine back up and go. But yeah, folks, I'm forever going to leave it here. Turn the lights back on. Have to see a little bit. But um, like I said, I'm just going to do field nine. 
and see how dark that is and uh, try to get field 9 out before it rains anyway if not look out for next episode via a nighttime harvest that's right folks we reached to uh, old 2000 hours or whatever you want to say that military time there and it's not started raining yet I might come back on and record another one while we're at it and do a nighttime harvest because we have to get these beans done but don't worry, I'm going to try to get, uh, oh crap, I'm going too far. Let's make a U-turn here. Oh, 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 not into the trees, not into the trees. Go over this ledge here. This pretty straight here, I'm going to see if, uh, That should do pretty well, hopefully. And who we got? We got Donna driving the combine. She got the tractor to get onto the combine. Go, Donna. You and Max Sam make a perfect team working out like that, taking turns. All right, let's, uh, we got to shut our lights off here. Get over to our disc here. And, folks. I hope y'all enjoyed this episode. Uh, I'm going to keep an eye on Donna while I just up this field here. And uh, give or take, next episode might be a nighttime harvest. Uh, but we got to do something because you see, we got rain now. Maybe that rain for Wednesday is what we're fixing to get because we're a couple of hours away from midnight. And that would work out great if it is. Now give it time to dry out. Maybe, maybe Thursday it'll be dry enough for us. Or, or Wednesday evening, you know. We might just have to cut a little bit each uh, evening. But as you can see, Sunday we're going to have snow. And uh, we got to get these beans out by then. Uh, probably should have cut the, the beans first, then the corn, because corn's taller, and, uh, you know, if it snows, it'd be all right. It'd be tall enough out of the snow. Hopefully it won't do that much. But, yeah. But, anyway, uh, I'm going to get this disted and watch her make sure she don't quit. And uh, I will see y'all next episode, folks. Thank you for all your love and support, comments. I appreciate all of it. And um, I will see y'all in the next one. All right. Later.